Okay, good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, We're starting a new unit of uppercase, big capital daddy letters. And so we're going to start with uppercase L. You can see it's just, it's a little bit different than the lowercase because there's a line. I'm going to put it up on our caterpillar and our caterpillar will grow big again. It's going to grow long as we learn the uppercase. And for our la la L, we're going to sing a song about la la light, which is our la la love. So stand up, touch your hand on your love, your heart, where all your light shines from. I know you know this song. So I want to see everyone singing loudly, okay? And doing it your best job. All right, you may sit down. Now, for our la la light, I have some light letters we're going to practice. But this time, you're going to use the flashlight. Okay, you can't shine it in anyone's eyes. We're only shining it on the board. And I will give you an idea of what letter I need you to write. And then you're going to write it on the board. Okay, so let's have Ty come up here first. Just hold it this way. And I'll show you the light, the letter I want you to make. Okay, don't tell them. Down, cross. T. T. Thea. Can you do this one? Ha. Ya. X. Good. Let's let Michaelia do this one. Michaelia. Hold it. Let me find you a good one. Ooh, can you do this one? Slide down and up. V. All right, I'm going to point to the letters with my la la light. I will say their names. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? This story we're going to read today is called Lazy Ozzy by Michael Coleman. Which one of these words starts with L? Lazy or Ozzy? Lazy. Lazy. Is it good to be lazy? No. No, we have to be hard workers, especially at school. And I don't think this owl is very hard working. He seems kind of lazy to me. Ozzy was a lazy owl. It's time you learn to fly, said Mommy Owl one day. But Ozzy said, oh, do I have to learn that? All that wing flapping looks like so much hard work. Ozzy's favorite thing was to sit around. He said, I'm going to practice being wise. What does wise mean? Smart. He wants to just practice being smart. Well, I want you to learn to fly, said his mother. Now, I'm going to look for some food, and if you are wise, you'll be on the ground by the time I come back. Ozzy thought hard. If he was wise, he should be able to think of a way to get on the ground without all that hard work wing flapping. Suddenly, he noticed a horse. The horse's head almost came up as high as Ozzy at, at, at the beam Ozzy was sitting on. Ozzy had a smart idea. Help! Help! He yelled. What's the matter, said the horse. It's an emergency! Ozzy jumped onto the horse's head and then slid to his back. Hurry! Hurry! Take me to the milk shed! The horse was so scared. He ran as fast as he could to the milk shed. In the milk shed, there was a cow who wasn't as high as the horse. Ozzy went from the horse's back to the cow's. Hurry, it's an emergency, Ozzy cried, jumping onto the not-so-high cow. Take me to the big sty. Hurry. So the horse and the cow were so scared they ran as fast as they could to the pig sty. In the pig sty, there was a pig who wasn't as tall as the cow. He was a big pig, and Ozzy jumped from, to the pig's back. Hurry, hurry, it's an emergency. Take me to the barnyard. So the horse and the cow and the pig ran as fast as they could. It's an emergency. What do you think the emergency is? Nothing. Maybe a fire? Maybe no, a wolf? Nothing. We'll see. In the barnyard, there was a sheepdog who wasn't as tall as the pig. 
He was short. Ozzie jumped from the pig to the sheepdog's back. Hurry, hurry, it's a, take me to the pasture. It's an emergency. So all the animals went running, and there lived a little la la lamb who wasn't as tall as the sheepdog. So Ozzy jumped from the, to the little lamb's back. Hurry, hurry, take me to the duck pond. It's an emergency. In the duck pond, there lived a little dinky duck. He wasn't very tall. It's an emergency, said Ozzy. He jumped to the dinky duck's back. Hurry, take me to the barn. So the horse and the cow and the pig and the dog and the lamb and the dinky duck ran as fast as they could. Emergency, emergency. And Ozzy jumped down from the dinky duck's back to the ground. He did it. Now he was on the ground. It was like stairs going down their backs. That's what you call being wise, he told himself. Well, what's the emergency, said the horse. Oh, said Ozzy, I was just kidding. Ha, ha, ha. Wasn't that funny? But was it funny? No. He lied. The horse and the pig and the dog and the lamb and the dinky duck were not amused. They went away grumbling. That duck tricked us. But Ozzy was happy. His plan worked. He had used them like stairs, hadn't he? Like ding, 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 ding. When his mommy came, he told a lie. I flew all the way down, he said proudly to his mother. Mother Owl gave him a smile. That's wonderful, she said. Ozzy thought she was pleased with him, but he didn't know she'd been watching the whole time. Well, let me see you fly back up again. Oh, no. How's he going to get back up? Did he really learn to fly? No. It's an emergency. Oh, no. Are they going to let him climb on the back again? No. Why are they trying to bite him? Why are they chasing him? He yeah, his friends aren't happy with him. They're chasing him around. So we had a few L words in here. We had la, 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 la. la lamb, lazy. lazy, and he told a la, la. lie. Three L words. Yeah. All right, we're going to sit on. Oh, you guys are already on a cloud. Perfect. So then I will come over there. Since you guys are already on a cloud, can I have Avery go sit on the number seven cloud? Just let everyone face the sun, face inward. Thank you. So I have some pictures of L words, and we're going to fish them up, and we can make a little silly story out of it. Okay, Mahina, you go first. Fish an L picture up. Once upon a time, there was a letter. Letter to who? To Santa? Santa. A letter to Santa. All right, go give to someone else. L for letter, la, la, letter, and, ooh, what is this? A lamb. Maybe the letter said, please bring me a? Lamb. A lamb. Let's say our story that we made. Once upon a time, we wrote a letter to Santa, la, la, letter, asking for a little la, la, lamb. And make sure you bring your ladder to climb up to the roof. And don't forget the la la leaves for our little lamb. I will turn out the lights so we don't peek. And the door will be locked. And don't bring me a lemon. Bring me a Christmas orange. And watch out, reindeer. There's lots of logs, so you got to jump over the logs. The end. Spread out to the letters, because we're going to do a la la limbo song. So everyone stand up. Some letters up here. What letter is this? Down, mountain, mountain. M. If you get an M word, put it there. What about down and a rainbow? Oh. If you get something R, put it there. Just down. L. Today's one. What about girl's head down and curl her hair? 
G. Down, tickle tummy, run away. K. K. All right, so you're going to get one of those, and whatever you get, you're going to put it under the right one. So I'll be calling up some of our friends, and let's have our boys come line up first. Come stand right over here, boys. I'm going to give you a goat. Ga, ga, goat. What does goat start with? Ga, ga, G. You're going to have a leaf. La, 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 leaf. La, 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 L. M was for Mama Monkey. Rainbow. R for Rainbow. Then we had La, la, leaf. La, la, lemon. La, la, lion. Then we have G for G Goat and Girl. And K for Keys. Very nice. You guys did an excellent job on that. All right, we're going to learn how to write capital L. It's very easy. It's down and straight. and straight. Now, some friends are going like this. Is no, that? Yeah. That's like a backwards J. It's more box. It's more like that. Don't make it hooky. Down and straight. It's almost like half of a rectangle. So when I give you the pen, I want to see your big L. Down and straight. Good. Down and straight. Oh, in our new books that we're going to have, there's going to be three lines. And these lines are our dotted roads that look like uh, the first line. We're going to make big capital L's. Down and straight. Down and straight. On the second one, we're going to make lowercase L. Just straight down, straight down. Stay in between the road. L, L. Then we're going to make a pattern. Big L, little L. Big L, little L. And now I need some ideas of some L pictures we could write. Skylar, what's a good idea? A lamb. She wants a little lamb. Oh, here's our little ears of our lamb, her little head, her eyeballs. She looks like a little fluffy white cloud with a little tail on her. Everyone say L, L A, 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 M, M and a silent B. Lamb. You hardly hear that B. Lamb. What else is another L thing we could write about today? Um, lion. Oh, let's do lion. Here's a lion with his ears and his head. How many eyeballs? Two. His nose with his whiskers. He needs a big mouth with what's inside? Teeth. Sharp, sharp teeth. And he needs a mane. Because if he doesn't have a mane, he won't look like a lion. He will look like a modern lion. And you don't have to draw the whole lion, but you could draw his, his legs too. But I'm just going to draw his head. Everyone say L. I, I, O, o N. N. I have room for one more idea. Okay, Lottie? Leaf. Ooh, leaf. I like that one. Because the little lamb loves to eat little leaves, doesn't he? So we're going to draw. So a leaf. Everyone say L, L E, e a, A, F. F. All right, this gives us three ideas for our book today. Uh, you don't have to do, you could just choose your favorite. You don't have to do all three, but you could choose your favorite one. So let me show you real quick. This is our new book we're starting. Our new writing book. And we're going to be on the first page, which is L. And the first row will be all big L's. Then the second row will be little L's. And then the pattern, big L, little L. Then you have some spaces, that's later for sentences, or for right now you can write your name. And then you see this big, wide, open space. Now instead of coloring a picture, you're going to be artist and draw your own picture. So you get to pick which one you want to draw. Who wants to draw the little lamb? Okay, who's going to draw the lion? Who's going to draw a leaf? And make sure you put the word under it too. So if you do the lamb, write L-A-M-B under it. And don't draw the lamb and then write lion. You have to make sure the right word goes with the right picture. Does everyone understand what we're doing? Yeah. 
All right, wave to our friends. Say bye, friends. <laughs>